Hi everyone, we'll now see how to plot network graphs with R. When I say network, any network, it might be a mail network, it might be a social network, it might be any network. Uh, we actually have network D3. Network D3 is a new uh, package from R. You got to see this, okay? I'm setting my working directory, I'm loading my data, and I just wanted to see a glance of data, and after that, I say simple network. And yes here it comes a simple network plot let me zoom it down to understand it you know in a, in a network plot generally the importance of a network plot is measured by three measures one is degree centrality one is betweenness centrality and one is closeness centrality okay so how do you measure the importance of a node if you see this node which is connected to two other nodes is this not connected to any part of the network no so what I'll do is I will try to drag this particular node to see uh, what's all it can drag. It's amazing. See, it can drag only two points. So it is connected to only two points, and its influence is only on two points. Okay. Uh, let me consider this point. Yeah. It is able to drag the entire network that is connected, right? Yes, it is. And what about if I drag this? the center one it should be able to drag the entire part but not the entire network right and even this case this is a node which is a bridge between this network and this network and I try to drag this network it's dragging a, a bit a bit a bit ah it did finally now I'll try to choose one central node which can drag the entire network when I say drag the entire network it has influence on all the network and it should be the central node mm, quite amazing it is right I can drag it anywhere on the entire network what do you think so this is network d3 plots where importance of each node will depend on the amount of graph it can drag hope you enjoyed the session if you have any more questions you can just uh, reply to this video. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye.